We end tonight in the West Texas desert where dreams as big as the sky sometimes come true. Here's Omar Villafranca. The stars at night are big and bright in Marfa, Texas. I see the Big Dipper. What else? A <laughs> um, bunch of sparkling, beautiful lights. Inspired by the cosmos, Colette, Ashley, Charlotte, Daniela, Madison, and Mabel decided to enter a nationwide science contest. Their team name? The Marfa Martians. It's kind of empowering, like young people, young women can do um, things like that too. If they won, their experiment would be performed on the ISS, the International Space Station, by real astronauts. But winning seemed like a long shot. More than 23,000 students were participating. Many were in high school. Sherry Alweto is their science teacher. I was trying to prepare them for not going on because they're young. And then they surprise me every single time we, we go on to a next step. Two milliliters of the sterile nutrient broth. The judges at the Smithsonian were impressed. The girls' experiment, how to kill bacteria in space, is heading to the ISS. If you want to do something and somebody says that you shouldn't do that, don't let them pull you down. Just do it. The girls celebrated by piling into the back of a pickup truck to catch a glimpse of their future. See that tiny white speck floating in the sky? That's the ISS flying by. Oh my God! We can actually see it. You can look up. Yeah, just right there. Awesome. Despite being one of the youngest teams from a tiny Texas town, the girls shot for the stars and landed on the International Space Station. Omar Villafranca, CBS News, Marfa, Texas.